Hi, Ava Seavey here from Avalanche. Welcome to our first summer hot topic of 2014. A lot of you probably heard about Dr. Oz coming under fire from Congress for endorsing products and supplements that were miracle cures. Um, he did have to admit that some of these things were not substantiated with clinicals and that he didn't have viable proof that some of these things really did what they said they were going to do. And since he carries a lot of weight of, as a doctor, Congress was very disturbed. Does this mean that we have to alter what we're doing as far as the nutritional supplement side of DRTV? Absolutely not. There's ways you can protect yourself and still do great, effective DRTV supplement advertising. First, make sure you have a great FTC attorney who knows the ins and outs of all the regulations. Second, try to work on products that do have clinicals, uh, at least two double-blind clinicals. And three, try to work with a company that has this particular expertise. If someone's great at doing a kitchen gadget, they might not necessarily know how to do a nutritional supplement. And there's a lot of great producers in the country that have a pretty good track record. Uh, in fact, we've had a very successful year in terms of nutritional supplement. So I know that you can get around these issues, that you can be successful, and if you're compliant and working on great products, you can have major success. So happy 4th of July and see you for the next hot topic.